Sublime. Completely sublime. Look at him. Yeah, he's sniffing it out today. Welcome, you awesome squatchers, to Off Green Whiskey. This is kind of a... Uh, I can't... That is just sublime. The perfect pooper, they call it. Scientists are still working it out how to get his buttocks uh, transplanted onto a human. They're going to clone that buttocks, the perfect pooper, and put it onto humans so we don't have to wipe anymore. No more wiping. Here's what happened. Uh, this is going to be a, like a beer slash. I got a, I got a few things to say about a book I'm reading. Look at this. I bought this just because it says off grid. It's an IPA here in Washington state. So, uh, I accidentally opened it before I said, going to brother get a nice cold. So thank you, Dennis Haysberg. That's where I learned that from the actor. I got another beer ski. This is the last one. That's the last one here. I thought I had more. That's why I opened it. Um, it this is Nature Calls, which I don't plan on reviewing this, but I just need to have that opening. Ready? One. Oops. Three, two. Gonna brother get a nice cold. Not a lot of cracking and fizzing. I'm not a fan. So, okay, I'm not drinking this one. Although I'm gonna have to now. <laughs> Hang on. Mm -hmm. Check it out. Look at Squash. Yeah, so let's put the Acrid IPA into a glass so you can see the nectar with uh, repos with the Squatch. Isn't that great? This is a beer festival I went to. Obviously, I had a few. I should fill that up a little more, right? Um, Bigfoot Brew Fest. Yes, Seabrook, Washington, near where I live here. See, it shows, oh, right here, Japan. Right, Seabrook, Washington, right there. I'm going to wear this shirt. Thank you, Mrs. Julie, for gifting this shirt to me. I'm going to wear it all the time so I can... Now I don't have to think. Meth Lab Explosion, South Aberdeen, right there. That's why Heat Wave today. And uh, they are cooking the meth, baby. Uh, let's try this. This is the off-grid IPA. I only bought it for the... I'm not a big IPA fan. Mm-mm. Yeah, that's not a lot of international intercontinental bitter units. Thank you, Ravishing Rick Rude. Uh, IBUs. It, well, I don't know. It doesn't say technically. I've. It just doesn't taste that to me, which I'm not a fan of anything over like, oh, what is it, 39 or so? I start going, eh, too bitter for me. This is from, oh, geez, Backwoods Brewing. Brewing, that's, that's how you pronounce that. Carson, Washington. Oh, no. Where the funk? Where is Carson, Washington? <laughs> is it down here or is it over here? It's in between Sasquatch's fortress forearm and his battleship biceps. I don't, I don't know where Car I think it's the east side of the mountains. You know, you know, for those of you who don't know, what Washington State, USA, has got the Cascade Range running right through, splitting Sasquatch in half, actually more over here. Big mountains, you know, Cascades, Mount Rainier, right there. Oh, my ta, -ta. <laughs> uh, And over here is a desert. Over here is green, like you see here, trees. They have green trees, too. I'm not uh, saying, but it's more of a desert, high plains, drifting, drifting desert. And a lot more rain over here. Way more rain. 100 inches where I'm at. And over here, probably give me two inches. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, on a good day. Mm. That's pleasant. I could drink that. Let me do a quick side by side. That's pleasant. I can drink that. <laughs> what is the, this is an IPA also. Nature Calls 10 Barrel. That I know is from um, uh, Oregon, Bend, Oregon, which is Bend, Oregon is way down here. <laughs> I don't want to bend over to show you Bend, Oregon, because uh, I may not get back up. There's only so many bendovers left in my life here. I can't. I went blind. I can't read. <sighs> Had too many already, maybe. <laughs> no, first one of the day. Scorching hot. Heat wave. Bigfoot Brewfest. Awesome. In Seabrook, Washington. 
Ooh, 6.2 ABV. That'll grab you by the poo-poo. Watch out. Uh, we welcome you to go off-grid and enjoy every minute of it. Okay, I am off-grid. That's that's true. And am I enjoying every minute of it? <laughs> Loving every minute of it. Yes, of course. That's why I'm doing this, doing these videos for you awesome Squatchers. I want you to uh, enjoy the love that's happening every minute with me and Papa Bear. Oh, he went out. He's loving it and enjoying it. There he is. Okay, side note, besides the beer skis, uh, I'm reading, you know, some Spur McCoy. That's why I'm rocking the hat. You know, this is a Western Bodice Ripper series. Watch out by Dirk Fletcher. Um, this is what I love about, this is my book review, Spur McCoy. In every book, uh, Mr. Fletcher, the author, besides all the, uh, oh, the Humpty dances that's going on with Spur and these buxom women that he runs into in these law towns, Spur is a, if you don't know, works for the Secret Service. He, they just started it. So he's got Missouri to the West. That's his ground he covers. So bank robbers, people like that. It's actually a cool premise, really. Think about it. Um, but he's always, he's, you know, big man Spur. You know, he calls his, he calls, he calls his wiener Lazarus. You know, <laughs> is wiener okay for you? Yeah. I was, I had a pause there for a second. What was I going to call it? Lazarus, because it rises from the dead. He can, many times it rises. But at the same time, while seducing and killing, he eats. And I just love the descriptions of Spur McCoy eating. He began with six hot cakes, the size of dinner plates, four eggs, six slices of bacon. Then it was almost noon. He had a steak and a bowl of chili. <laughs> what? Uh, where's the outhouse? <laughs> Spur, you may want to uh, evacuate the dance floor after eating all that. About midnight, they got out of bed and renewed their energy with fresh boiled coffee. He drinks a lot of coffee. And more apple pie. Spur had two more pieces and a slab of homemade cheddar cheese. Yeah. The next morning, fried eggs. The last slab of bacon. Uh... Potatoes, hash browns, yeah, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> this is uh, where's my favorite? Ooh, she worked over the wooden cook stove. Spur smelled a delicious aroma, right? Um, the cooking steak, cinnamon rolls, steak, potatoes, fresh peas, applesauce, and four pots of hot coffee. <laughs> oh yeah, he's really worth. He's gonna hit that outhouse after four pots of hot coffee. <laughs> Anyways, that is my review of Spur McCoy. Uh, oh, question for you smart, awesome Squatchers. Now, the title of this one, you know, they got these catchy names. Missouri Madam, uh, Helena Hellion, and, oh, hang on, Gold Town Gal, Red Rock Redhead. Now, what is Kansas City Chorine? Corine? C-H-O-R-I-N-E. Now, this is the most baffling title. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Chorine? Corine? I mean, look at it. Dodge City Doll. Frisco Foxes. You know, I get those. Um, Laramie Lovers. I understand that. What is... This is the most complex title. Or, not complex. Most complexing? No. Perplexing. <laughs> I don't know. I'm confused. How about that? It's pretty obvious, isn't it? Uh, you know, Indian made. I mean, I get Wyoming wench. I get that. Wyoming wench. <laughs> what about the uh, New Orleans? Uh, uh, I won't get into that. <laughs> or the Cancun elephantitis. You know, I've, I've been there in 1992. So let me know, you awesome squatchers. You know, comment. What is Chorine? I, I can't Google it right now. I don't have service. Hang on, let's have a resuscitating split of IPA backwoods. What is it? Oh, I off grid. Yes, thank you. Off grid IPA. We need to renew some energy here. I'm too. I don't have enough. Lazarus must rise. So that's it. That's all I got for you. Good beer ski. I would uh, backwoods brewing from Carson, Washington, somewhere 
in the vasectomy of right in here, I guess. I don't know. You people from Carson, I know there's a lot of Carson subscribers out there. <laughs> Let me know where you are in Washington State. And we can, I'm hoping it's not, you know, it's, that would, where is Bigfoot's yeah, Lazarus? You know, is it, uh, what town is that is what I'm asking. Let me know if you know that. Googles it, Bigfoot Lazarus. <laughs> it's going to rise. <laughs> All right. Uh, off grid out. First time ever. Never done off grid out. Papa Bear, what do you think of that?